edition of GQ Plus One. Uh, it feels great. We're excited to see the designers that are showing their collections. Um, a lot of them we're huge fans of. We wear a lot of their clothes throughout the year, so um, it feels great to come out here and support them and see what they're coming up with next. And yeah, I'm also really stuff. happy to be going to a show that's focusing on menswear. Yeah. It happens so rarely, so I'm I'm excited to see what everyone does. All right. Um, what would be your style advice for the year, for the year 2018? I read somewhere that the latest trend is no trend mm. and I freaking love that because <laughs> I don't think that trends work for everybody yeah. so I think you just do what works for you just do you so having no trends is great all right um, one last question individually what is your favorite thing in your wardrobe and what's yours my favorite thing in my wardrobe is a jacket that was um, customized by an artist named who goes by Bakwas. All of her stuff is Bakwas. Uh, Babu the painter. So that's another favorite thing that I have in my wardrobe. Mine is probably my collection of boots. She's got a lot of shoes. And also a lot of shoes. And also my um, <laughs> velour Adidas burgundy tracksuit pants. Yes, I borrow it all the time. They give me life. Mm -hmm. जितना कर सकता हूँ इसे एक एक पैर के साथ उतना एंजॉय करने वाला हूँ। But I have a long association where it's a very old association with GQ. I'm here for Che, I'm here for GQ, and Anil sir is I think he's a he's a showstopper, right? So yeah, I'm working with him. I love him immensely. So I'm here to show my support. Rohit Bal, I'm wearing Rohit Bal, yeah. Yeah, sure. So what's your style advice for the year 2018? Year 2018. Just be yourself, man. Don't copy anyone. Um, just wear what you feel like wearing. Don't listen to anyone. And one more question. Uh, what is the most precious thing to you in your wardrobe? In my wardrobe? Oh, I think I have some 15 plain white t-shirts and some 15 or 20 blue denims. Of course, there are clothes as well, but these two. I, I love wearing denims and white t-shirts. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I don't know. I've, I've stopped counting now, but quite a lot, quite a lot. Thank you. Thank you. Status तो बहुत अच्छा है. Status बहुत अच्छा है. Shoot चल रही है. Almost अभी खत्म होने को है. और of course अगले साल release है उसका अभी. I'm just looking forward to it. I'm gonna the moment I'm I'll be better. I'll resume my shoot. बहुत अच्छा रहा, बहुत अच्छा रहा। अनिल सर के साथ अभी एश्वर्य जी के साथ शूट नहीं हुआ है अभी, पर अनिल सर के साथ बहुत अच्छा रहा है, बहुत ही मजा आया, and I'm I'm very excited for the film.
Who are you wearing tonight? I'm wearing a Nikhil Shantanu. I think this is from his new collection. I'm really looking forward to it. Um, and yeah, I think this, these are the only places you really bump into your friends. So I'm also meeting Nikhil Shantanu after really long and I love them. So I'm looking forward to it. Yeah? Who's your favorite designer? <laughs> well, uh, Indian? Uh, Nikhil, Nikhil Shantanu and uh, Manish. Okay. Yeah. And what is your style portion? Less or more? Less. Less? Always less, yeah. And how many pair of shoes do you own in your wardrobe? I have no idea. Um, I, I have a problem when it comes to bags and shoes. Mm -hmm. I just keep buying them and I honestly have never counted. Uh, in terms of what's in? Yes. So what is it that um, you look up to? Well, to be very honest, uh, I have never really followed trends. Uh, and I can't just blindly wear something because it's in. I think most importantly, you need to just understand what suits your body type. And just go ahead and wear that, please. Not just because it's in. And what is the most precious thing in your wardrobe? I have many precious things. Many precious yeah, not just one. <laughs> That's it? Van Hassan GQ Fashion Night. How does it feel? Oh, it's, it feels uh, awesome. Uh, it's uh, always a pleasure to be here, surrounded by uh, the next season of uh, fashion and style. And uh, it's GQ, so we expect the best. And who's your favorite designer? Uh, Shantanu Nikhil. Yeah. And what is your personal style quotient, less or more? I mean, I don't know, man. I think it's just wear everything you got. <laughs> That's it. Uh, yeah, actually, uh, I'm trying to be as me as I can be. So, uh, this is me. Like at home also, so I wear my hat with my shorts and stuff like that. So, it's kind of weird, but it's me. Hmm. <laughs> Uh, sorry, sorry, for that question uh, again, please. Uh, 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 G. Uh, uh, G. Uh, 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 because we keep ourselves away from the negatives. Uh, I think it's uh, just positive, hai, even if a married couple is telling you to use protection, uh, maybe they're trying to put some sense in your head to understand that uh, it's uh, free will is, is our responsibility. It's not to be misused. So protect yourself and your loved ones and be responsible. Okay, last question. What is your style advice for 2018? Uh, be yourself and uh, I guess, yeah, just be yourself, man. Be yourself, like, really. Thank you so That's much. Right. Thank you. Can you please come here for a few questions? So, how does it feel to be at the third edition of Van Hussein GQ Fashion Night? Amazing! It feels great. Actually, it's my first fashion night out. Before this, I was at the GQ Men's Award, which is also really, really cool, I must say. And it's my first time, my first year in the industry and in the fashion industry. So, it feels amazing. And who's your favorite fashion designer? There are so many. You know, it's unfair to name one. Uh, Manish Malhotra, who's a close friend. Abu Janib, Sandeep Bosla, um, Shabina Khan. Karan Johar, there are so many, you know, it feels very unfair to name one. But all of them, they're all coming up with great trends, great clothes, and just looking forward What's to today. personal style portion? Let Depends on my mood, to be honest, you know. I feel like how style many, is something. How many pair of shoes do you own? <laughs> Quite a few. Quite a few, yeah. Do you want to know about your wedding? Yes. I'm just wearing a bangla, and I'm going to marry her after this. I'm wearing a friend's wedding. So, I'm wearing a Jodhpuri, it's by Shabina Khan. So, yeah. 
आपकी पिक्चर्स को तोड़ के आया था आपके नाम को तोड़ के आया था क्या और मैं मैं क्या बोलूँगा यार मेरा रिएक्शन क्या था नथिंग टू बी ऑनेस यू नो हम अगर हम पार्टी में हैं और हम पिक्चर्स ले रहे हैं तो वॉट्स द हार्म इन दैट यू नो येस लॉट ऑफ पीपल है ओपिनियंस टू से कुछ ना कुछ बोलेंगे बट आई डोंट थिंक दर वॉज एनी थिंग टू द फोटो यू नो इट वॉज जस्ट आस वॉल हैविंग अ ग्रेट टाइम इट वॉज द सक्सेस ऑफ द पदमावती ट्रेलर और आई थिंक शी इज़ हैविंग अ पार्टी ऑफ अ लॉन्ग टाइम इज ग्रेट एप सब लोग थे साथ में उस वक्त तो आई थिंक इट वॉज अ ग्रेट टाइम यू नो जिस टू इन्जॉय आर सेल्फ जरीब में दैट्स अबाउट इट बस इतना ही लेके हाँ जी आई थिंक यू नो टू बी ऑनेस्ट आई थिंक इट ऑल हैपन्स विद द प्रोड्यूसर ये जो टॉपिक है आई थिंक इट्स नॉट फेयर फॉर मी टू से इट्स मॉर फॉर संजय जी एंड फॉर दीपिका एंड रणवीर एंड शायद वो रिप्रेजेंटिंग द फिल्म फॉर देम टू से बट आई जस्ट फील लाइक यू नो वेन एन इंडस्ट्री जहाँ पे एंटरटेनमेंट है वे एंटरटेनिंग पीपल थ्रू अ स्टोरी इट्स अ ग्रेट स्टोरी पदमावती यू नो ऑफकोर्स इट इज टू डू विथ हिस्ट्री लेकिन आई थिंक वी शूड गिव अ फेयर चांस यू नो टू द फिल्म दे वर्क सो हार्ड इन द फिल्म दे शॉर्ट फॉर टू हंड्रेड फिफ्टी डेज दो सौ पचास दिन से उन लोग शूट कर रहे हैं यू नो सम शॉर संजय जी एज अ मास्टर पीस इन एंड गिव चांस ऑफ वर्क गिव इस फिल्म ऑफ वर्क अ चांस यू नो तो देखेंगे आगे जाके आई थिंक इट्स स्टिल दे स्टिल शॉर्टिंग आउट वट ऑफ द मैटर्स एंड आई एम नो वॉन्ट टू सेम इज लुकिंग फॉर्ड टू दूवी जस्ट बी कम्फर्टेबल विद इन योर ओन स्किन आई फील यू नो जस्ट ड्रेस डोंट ड्रेस टू इम्प्रेस फील कम्फर्टेबल वैन यू फील कम्फर्टेबल यू विल ऑलवेज फील स्टाइलिश आई थिंक दैट्स द ईजीएस थिंग थैंक यू सो मच इट फील्स गुड यू नो दीज कैंड ऑफ इवेंट्स मेक मी Uh, it they force me to dress up and uh, look good otherwise i'm quite clumsy so yeah it feels good what is your style statement my style statement yes just be comfortable i feel that's the most important thing and yeah white uh, white shirt denim brown shoes and what is that one precious thing in your wardrobe that you can't do without jog jeans yeah and one thing that you would not miss to carry on a beach holiday shorts ganji chappals <laughs> Very, very I'm wearing uh, hello how are you I'm wearing uh, antaragni ujwal dupe to ye unki karamat hai aapki kuch upcoming projects ke baare mein bata soon 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 dance par bhej dogi ya aap bhi dance par karni hai mujhe kuch i think uh, uh, to main karunga zyada kar remo ke paas hi jaunga so let's see Yeah, I would like to wish Ayar sir all the very best. We are a huge fan. Uh, when I was a child, also I used to hear songs from Dil Se and Chaya Chaya and stuff like that. He's a he's actually a legend and uh, a musician which is not just renowned in India, worldwide. So yes, it's it's it's, it's great that he's an Indian, and it's great that I'm a part of the film industry where he's working at the same time. What are your New Year plans, Jackie? My New Year plans plans I think I'll be doing a film uh, and I'll be working uh, in London. So I'll take 25th is my birthday, so maybe I'll, I it's a choice between 31st and 25th. So I'll take 25th off. And one last question: What is your advice for the youth for 2018 in terms of style and fashion? <laughs>
so which is why it's great so which is why it's great to be here for the GQ fashion nights uh, uh, today it's all about the boys though so uh, let's make it about them welcome to the van Hughes and GQ fashion nights in association with Google Pixel 2 New well, uh, I will be announcing a Hindi film soon, so I'll tell you guys once I can do that. Absolute Phoenix, Reliance Digital, and NDTV Good Times, the Lifestyle Park. Thank you for their makeup. He's one of my favorites, uh, so it was great that for Mohit Jadaro, we actually had Rehman composing. Uh, I think I, I personally believe, I, I always say he's got God in his voice, I think. Uh, his... Uh, voice is something that's amazing and the way he thinks about it, music is great so thank you so much and congratulations and hopefully uh, Rehman sir you're gonna have a lot of lot more years to come how would, how would I define fashion uh, it is being able to say who you are without actually using words thank you. Okay, the last uh, two years or so as a brand, uh, we've been uh, representing India in a very sartorial way, you know, uh, uh, this collection was another glorious chapter, I think, in, in for, for us when it comes to India, it's, it's a collection that we wanted to see through the eyes of the millennials, which is where there's an India on the move feel to it, you know, so we've taken Thar as a backdrop, uh, Thar is... Um, as you know, it's in Rajasthan and uh, everything around Rajasthan, the streets of Rajasthan, the nuances of that uh, through the eyes of the millennials who are looking at big dreams and, and they carry a certain uh, amount of restless energy. And I think we just wanted to bring that in a sartorial way. It's almost like saying India on the move for us, it's migrating India. And Radhika obviously uh, is a millennial. I think she owns the space that she is uh, in right now. She. Uh, has that whole indie feel to her and there was like you saw in the collection there was a, a bit of gender neutrality there was uh, it was kind of genderless and I think she befits that role beautifully my uh, experience was very good and you're right I felt that comfort and uh, I felt like I owned it and it's because seriously when I came here and I wore this and this whole look came together it felt like me um, and uh, I think that's the best thing if you have to walk around and if you feel extremely comfortable it literally feels like skin to me and uh, their theme and their thought behind the whole collection is also something that I find very relatable uh, to my journey and my life. I am from Bombay and I have brought something that, is, that I be, it belongs to me and Bombay has given me the space to be myself and yet accepted me as a part of it. So every person creates their own unique space and I think that's the whole theme and the thought behind the collection today. Yeah. So, so what do you have to say about Van Houston and GQ Fashion Night as a platform for designers like you? 
fashion. I think uh, when you look at uh, venues in GQ Fashion Nights, it's a it's a men's only fashion week, you know. So, uh, and I think men have been an ignored species, uh, at least in this part of the world. Uh, we've never had uh, dedicated menswear showing in platform, and I think GQ <coughs> as a menswear uh, publication has done a tremendous job in boosting um, a certain amount of confidence for menswear to look at trends which were till about recently only women's wear. So you know, uh, I think GQ has given us the platform to explore a little bit of femininity even in our menswear. We started this whole drape philosophy, layering it with structure for men at GQ because I think we've always catered to a GQ man and I think there is a very strong GQ man inside all of us in India and there is a GQ woman uh, and I think um, that's why her. And I think, but I also think there's no man and women, woman yeah. in, in especially what you have created as well. And you know, it's just, I think, gender neutral. Yeah, I think there is this underlying um, trend now that uh, women and men are starting to feel that they belong together. Uh, so I think that that movement has started. और हमने as designers अपने कोशिश करी कि कपड़ों के थ्रू करें और हल्का सा मेन का इन्फ्लुएंस डाला है but femininity both men and women में so that's what no gender is for us what are the outfits and color that you can never go wrong with I think for see the Indian skin palette is quite incredible uh, and that's why we have so many colors in this part of the world uh, but having said that uh, there are certain colors of um, you know, like the ochre, uh, the greys, the emerald greens, the navy blues, a lot of masculine colours, I think, work across all platforms on Indian skin. I am not really sure that red is the right colour for an Indian woman. That's my take. Um, and what trends should we look out for in the year 2018? I, like I said, uh, I think it's now time has come where women and men are sharing clothes. Uh, the process of wearing structure with drape is the trend for time to come and I also think street couture is coming into play where they don't have to think too hard to wear clothes but just mix and match so styling is going to be very important what is the actors it's hard to say I think when you look at people doing things personally um, it's hard to judge uh, in, in my manner like if I was to wear a stripe and a, and a check together it's my personal choice but then people may not accept it uh, in design, the beauty in design is you can really have a lot of fun and be yourself. Radhika, uh, Radhika you have also written the script for Bombay Talkies too and you will be collaborating with Anurag again. Uh, something that we can talk about that project. I have not written the script. I don't know where the article came from. It's written by Anurag and uh, this is not the platform to talk about it. That's you are part of Bombay Talkies too, right? I, I will talk about it some other time. Sorry. Thank, thank, I can't. Any nominations from your side for the GQ man of the year? No. <laughs> I mean, I don't know. Us guys, uh, they are them, yes. <laughs> Nominate us, no? no? Not just nomination, they get the award as well. you have to award Thank you. Thank, Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I'm going to go to the house.
You feeling cold? Really? With, with the shawl, of course I'm not. Sahil and Asia, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> so how do you feel walking the ramp? Huh? How do you feel walking the ramp? Amazing. In fact, I'm not used to uh, walking the ramp, but this is good fun. And uh, I was, I, for a change, I did not smile that much. My manager was telling me not to smile. How many clothes are you wearing? One, two, three. Three layers. Three layers. कि फॉल फॉल कलेक्शन है ना फॉल विंटर है फॉल विंटर कलेक्शन है तो ये अभी बॉम्बे में गर्मी लग रही है लेकिन मैं दिल्ली के हिसाब से ड्रेसअप हुआ हूँ अभी मैं परफेक्ट हूँ मैं कूल हूँ मैं हमेशा कूल रहता हूँ साहिल आओ ना यार साहिल आओ ना यार सो इट्स 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 ऑल अबाउट लेरिंग्स बे� uh, a parka, he's wearing uh, a knit inside and he's wearing uh, this poncho on top. So it's all about, I mean, giving you the feel of winters, of course. Which creatures are bears? Polar bears, the polar okay. bears. Okay. Yeah, the Can collection is called High Bear Nation, okay. which has come from High Bear Nation, which bears go into, and so it's quickly Daniel. turned into High Bear. And what do you have to say about Dan Houston and Geo as a platform? Again, I mean, this is my second year, you know, uh, out of the three years they've been showcasing. So I've been, I've been very. Uh, you know, it's an honor for me to be part of it, uh, you know, a second year again and uh, yeah, and uh, I'm glad he was there today to support me and he looks so good. I'm a huge fan of his collection. In fact, I've been wearing a lot of his stuff for my events, for my gigs. So this is good And fun. I'm again honored when he said that. So. What are the key trends this season? Ayushman Khurana? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I think apart from that, it's 90s uh, because I'm very yeah, like... Yeah, so everything is very, it's very 90s. 90s. Yes, even the shoes. High waistbands, yeah. shoes, yeah. classics. Everything is, so, yeah. is back to 90s. You know, I think the whole fashion game is changing back to like, you know, what, what we used to see back in 80s and 90s. And uh, uh, so, the, the, uh, so the vibe is, uh, <laughs> the vibe is very chill and easy. You know, like it's not, it's not... Uh, it's not power dressing anymore for everything, you know. You can't put power dressing in everything, right? Like Since the 90s kids, also. I think this yeah. life has come full circle. Yeah, for us. like we all grew up because in the 90s. Yeah, this is the first yeah. time we are seeing our fashion coming back. Yeah. We used to wear as kids. Exactly. Yeah. yeah. Even the our parents, jeans, yeah, they have yeah. seen this, yeah. but we are seeing it the first time. Yeah. So yeah. I just want, I just want actresses to have a lot of options when it comes to experimentation with their looks, feet, clothes, or accessories or anything. Do you think? Men really have that limited options or you think? I think you think now we have now? because uh, there's kind of, uh, there's, there's a lot of congruent areas now in fashion yeah. with uh, because there are a lot of layers, the, the silhouettes are more effeminate also at the same yeah. time. Like look at this, it's, 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 it's even a girl wearing this look very, very hot I think. Yeah. So I think it's, it's become congruent now. Arishman, uh, Bollywood fashion, how do you look at it? On Bollywood screen, fashion on screen. on screen, it depends on the character you play. I'm hardly fashionable on screen because the kind of characters I play, I play in real films. I play middle class roles and uh, realism in cinema. So that way I think my fashion, I cannot really portray that side of mine on screen. I have not got chance, got, got any chance to do that on screen. But off screen, I think I'm quite fashionable. Arishman, who uh, is person who you go to person for fashion? यार मेरी स्टाइलिस्ट आयशा भंसाली वो मुझे फैशन एडवाइस देती है मेरा भाई अपार शक्ति फैशन एडवाइस देता है मुझे काफी आखिर चारों नहीं मैडम अभी कंटिन्यूटी हाँ काफी मक्खन हो रहे हैं आप सब जगह आप टीवी हो दो दो स्क्रीन पे एक साथ दिखाई देते हैं मक्खन हो रहे मतलब कैसे दो दो एक स्क्रीन पे एक साथ मतलब दो दो स्क्रीन my guest appearance is in your room. I'm very excited for it. I'm a radio jockey today, so Vidya Balan's role is in the radio jockey. So my guest appearance is in there as Ayushman. How many numbers are you? No, it's just one guest appearance. That's why it's called a guest appearance. And in one film, you probably have your brother and you... Yes, Happy Bhag Jai. It's not my dates work out, so my brother is doing one character in Happy Bhag Jai. Returns. Yeah. Okay guys, thank you. I'm sorry, I have to take my message. Yeah, yeah, go for it. Um, could you guys point out at least five uh, things that a man should have in his wardrobe? I think a style should answer that. Five things? You want yeah. five, not six, not four. Five. Uh, I think a cool pair of uh, jeans, a white shirt, a cool sneakers. Um, what else? A nice, uh, you know, if you like a uh, wallet, a nice wallet, um, and a nice cologne, for sure. Right? 
Oh. I second that, yeah, of course. Yeah. I used to have a lot of collection of uh, bow ties, but I've, I've stopped wearing bow ties these days. But uh, yeah. yeah, I think I have a lot of pocket squares as well. And uh, yeah, nice pocket squares are great. Well. Pocket squares are great to just uh, enhance like a simple look. You know? Yeah. So I think, see, he did better than me. <laughs> no, no, I just had it too. That's it. Arshman, uh, yeah. the most precious thing in your wardrobe? My boxes. You have to be comfort down there. Huh? No, I said.